Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I, I support the gentleman from North Dakota's amendment. It's a good amendment. And the gentleman from Florida, Mr. Gates, is right on target. Cops wear body cams, but the FBI agent interviewing a three-star general doesn't have to record that conversation? That makes no sense, especially when you know the facts around that conversation that took place. Remember, in January of 2017, January 4th, 2017, the agents on the Michael Flynn case, three-star general, served our country for over 30 years. The agents on the case said, we want to drop this case. There's nothing here. They didn't want to pursue it. But what happened? The director of the FBI told Peter Strzok to tell the agents, no, 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 don't drop the case. We're going after Michael Flynn. The next day, January 5th, 2017, Jim Comey meets with then-President Obama and talks about Michael Flynn. And what happens 19 days later? What happens 19 days later? These agents, not my words, Jim Comey's words, these agents are snuck into the White House. Mr. Comey doesn't follow the proper protocols, the proper process. He doesn't notify the White House counsel. He, doesn't, he sneaks them in to set up Michael Flynn. And... There's no recording of that interview. There's the 302 notes. And guess what they do with the notes? They change them months later and prosecute a general, prosecute American citizen based on that. And all the gentleman's asking is, let's fix that. Let's at least have an audio recording of that conversation that took place. And the Democrats say, we need to study it. What? Let's just pass it. That is, that is as, com as, as Mr. Gates said, let's get with the times. Let's get with the times. We're doing a virtual hearing. We can't even see half the Democrats who are supposed to be on the screen participating. We can't even see that. But somehow the FBI can interview people, American citizens, charge them with something that turns out not to be a crime. We, we, we know there was nothing there because the Justice Department said there's nothing there. They're dropping the case. And you guys want to study making an audio recording of those type of interviews. This is as basic and simple and straightforward as it gets. The gentleman from North Dakota knows what he's talking about. He has worked in this area. So let's adopt this amendment, common sense, thoughtful, good amendment that, that needs to happen, particularly in light of what we have lived through the last three years, what we have now learned took place. This is as straightforward as it gets. And I would urge adoption of the amendment.